which is the is the rocket. And then from here you've got the submarine and nature is mm -hmm. the general focus in this yep. area. Um, and that's where you get the, the, the first kind of feature, the biophilic area with the tree, which is sort of a bit of dwell time intended to be there. The point is, I think, as you come down this way and go down into the, the next level, is, is that's where this connection to, to nature is, that your, your clouds play a particular part. It was a very noisy space. When it's full, this place is, uh, it became quite a cacophony. And um, the challenge for the project really was to try and change that. We have the Airbus uh, Solar Zephyr, and it's suspended there amongst these wonderful absorbers, which are woolly shepherd clouds, and they have such a, um, a lovely texture to them. Visually, they do a great job in terms of the absorption throughout this area of the space and they work with the rest of the exhibit to achieve a visual um, wow factor as well that combines as part of the acoustic solution for the whole space. And the thing is, acoustics is, is so central to our lives uh, because without it we are, we are unconnected to our environments.